Turn to the story of Enrique and Barry. They found a little bit of trouble in Small Rock. Some bandits decided they were going to try and bust free one of their own. But Barry and Enrique decided they'd stop them at any costs. Let's see how they failed. So here we are back in Shadows of Brimstone and we are doing the jailbreak. Alex, take it away. They're coming. They're coming for him. His gang is coming to break him out. The high-profile prisoner, locked in the sheriff's jail, smiles at you with a wink. Now you boys are in for it. So we're going to have to defeat the bandits before they manage to get out their, um, their prisoner. And he's this guy over here. They're trying to break him out. The dynamite's going to blow up, and this guy's going to try and hot tail as quick as he can to get to the horse. Unfortunately, we can't kill the prisoner or interact with him anyway. Uh, but we do just have to kill a couple of bandits, which shouldn't be too hard, right? Hey, how hard can it be? I mean, we didn't have any trouble with the undead last time, right, Alex? Um, no, 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 I mean, it was not trouble per se, you know, just, uh, just a slight irritation. Slight irritation? Slight irritation. Right. So, we have the bandits. Let's take a look at these guys. So, they got bandit pistols, uh, range six, three shots, though, so they're actually better than we are. Um, they've got a head of bullets, so bandits range to hits roll of six, cause three hits each. Range, five plus melee, four plus combat, two, damage, two. Defense 3 and Health 3. 15 XP for taking these guys out. And we don't have any elite abilities on them, so that's pretty cool. Um, so, yeah. I'm starting off. We had to roll randomly, and I'm starting off down here in the very uh, corner here. And Alex, the poor guy, is what's standing between the bandits and... Uh, yeah, and their goal. So, Alex, as you have a lantern, you still got to hold back the darkness. Okay, let's hold back the darkness. Ah, I've got a 10. Okay. Let me just double check why you're holding back the darkness. Yeah. Oh, okay. So, yeah. The hold back the darkness roll is going to be used for moving this up further. Mm -hmm. Okay? At the moment, we only have to kill five people. Okay. If you fail, we're going to get more reinforcements coming in. Okay. So, we have, to, we have to keep holding back the darkness and killing off these guys. Okay. Right. So, um, their initiative is five. So, we currently have the same initiative because my initiative has gone down by one because of my um, chest wound. Uh, but I get to go first. So let's roll and see my roll for move. Three. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Um, I'm gonna use my, my grit that I have, my one yeah. grit, to add a d6 roll to this. So I have a speed of six. And I can reach this guy. So I'm gonna shoot at this first guy here. Wish me luck, guys. Let's just use white for um, white for us. Yeah. And just remind you as well. Um, so last time I was at the sheriff's office, I managed to pick up a wanted poster um, for. I get to discard to when I kill an outlaw enemy to gain d6 times 50 gold. So hopefully I'll get to use that this round. Or not. So I come around the corner, Alex, shooting away, but. My grit is gone. Oh dear. Okay, so these guys are going to activate and we have to then see who they're going to attack. So they have something called shootout. Uh, so, enemies with shootout prefer range attacks over melee. They move and target using shootout markers with the following procedure. Um, if adjacent to a hero at the start of activation, they move away. Target a random hero without a shooter marker yet and move the shortest distance to be within range of line sight. Okay, so Alex, if you roll three dice, okay, and these are who they're going to target. Four, five, six is me, one, two, three, it's you. So all three of them are, you. are aiming for me. So there should be some shootout markers, the purple ones in there. Yeah, yeah. yeah. How many? So three of those. Three of those. Okay, and these guys have got a range of six. So he can actually already shoot me. He can shoot me. This guy is going to come for me. And we roll a dice to see if he can 
move yep so so i fired at them so rightfully so they're going to attack me alex and this is where i'm going to get taken out in the first go okay so uh, alex you're rolling um nine dice Use your red ones, the bad guys. Or are they the good guys? <laughs> <laughs> uh, two, four, six, seven, nine. It's a nine. What do I need? What do I need not to get? Uh, you want to get under five. Fours, fours are below. Fours are below. You son of a glitch. Okay, so put the sixes to one side. Oh, I'm taking out straight away, Alex. You're joking? Uh, probably will be. Luckily, we've got a revive thing. Okay, so um, i basically got to get through. I've got to defend all four of these. Okay. Five more. So I defend two of those. I think I get to choose, so I'm going to defend two of these. Okay, so I'm taking... How many sixes did I have? Three. Okay, sorry. We would have to go back there. So they actually got three sixes, yeah? Yeah. And I got two sixes, didn't I? And yeah. two other things. There were two sixes and something that wasn't else. So these actually are three hits each. So I need to... I think I think it was three sixes. I might be wrong. They had three hit sixes. Yeah. Okay, so basically that means... That's for one of those. Mm -hmm. Sorry, that's for, that was my roll for one of those, but yeah. I, I actually hadn't got a five. It was like a one or something. So I blocked two of those hits out. Um, that was for that one. And then I have to roll three dice for that and three dice for that. Nice. Um, so that's blocked two of those hits. Each hit does two damage, so two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. You kidding? But I'm going to use the revive token that we have to automatically come back. Yeah. And I get a grit for it. That was ridiculous. Okay, well I've got a got a bit of a bit of a plan. So you still with dynamite, right? I've got dynamite. That's exactly what I'm going to do. Right? Okay, roll to move. <laughs> Can't do a lot with that. Well, you've got maximum grit, so you get to add a d6 to your movement. But I've got to you spend those. No. Nope. Oh, okay. Yeah, automatically. Okay. So you've got a one already. So I've got one already, so I can add uh, one of these to make it a two. Hey! So just aim there, right? <laughs> yeah. Right, hey, <laughs> right, so you're not checking it over there, but right, you're checking it over here. Oh, of course, yeah. Okay, so roll um, your strength check, so that's four, four dice, you need a three or more. Yep, so now you have to roll a d6 for each, each one, so you're rolling three, three dice. Okay, they have three hit points. You ignore the defense, so you kill all three of those guys in one go. So, one, two, three. Okay. Well done. These guys are, are gone. And you get 45 experience points. Have you got a five there? Uh, no. Okay. Here is 45 experience points for taking out. Cool. Um, actually, you know what? I'll, I'll use that if I need it. I need to get another stick of dynamite, don't I? Might not need it. Um, okay. Now I can move, right? Well, there's no you already moved. You already moved and you oh, you're shot. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so if you take back one of the dynamites, one of the dynamites goes. Okay, and now if you roll the dice for me, and that's, we're going to get that many uh, bandits halved. Uh, that halved. Yep. 
two yeah. bandits. Okay, and then um, roll the dice once. So they're coming out C. <laughs> roll it again. A random building's rooftop. So they have bandit um, bandit rifles. And uh, can you roll the dice to see which rooftop they're going to? So he's on the roof. So this is their rooftop there. Mm -hmm. Okay, so what we do for, because I've never had to do um, this before. Okay, that's cool, good. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So what we have to do is you actually have to differentiate that he's on here on the rooftop and you have to put 10 of these tokens down and you put them on top. All right, so, so we, we're not, we're not going to get those sanity, sanity points. No, no. <laughs> yeah, no, no. <laughs> right, hold back the darkness, please. Do not get um, below seven, please. Okay, that moves at one. So we're going to have, we've got to take out another bandit. Right, uh, I'm going to roll to move. You know, I've really got to sort that out. Every time I go to roll, I always drop one. I'm like, that's not what I wanted. <laughs> Do you know what? I would have had a free attack against him because of my quick draw. So I got a hit, but it was soaked by defense. Right, now it's my turn, so I'm gonna attack. Two hits. Did I roll to move? No. No, okay, I'll roll to, I'll roll to move now. Okay, I got a grit, that was good. <laughs> Just don't roll a one again. Oh, you, got, oh, you did get grit, yeah. I've got two grit on here. I'm not sure if I should have two grit. But Actually, just, that's a good point. You know, I, you know, I rolled a one originally, but I, I had full grit. Ah, I you had the d six movement. You added to it. You got a d six to roll. To yeah, move. yeah. I just said I was at full grit anyway, so I didn't get the grit. No, you didn't get the grit, but you got to move. Okay, so I've done uh, two damage to this guy, but I'm going to add that. So blammo, this guy's gone. Um, I'm going to turn on my wanted poster. Wish me luck, Alex. I need Good to luck. get at least a three. Oh, for five minutes. So I only got 50 gold for that. So I lost 50 gold for that outlaw thing. Uh, okay, so I'm going to move. Oh, I'm going to use my grit to re-roll that. Hey, here we go. So $300. Just chuck them on my way. That worked out better. Okay, and I'm just going to move one here, so I'm in cover. Uh, right, this guy activates now. Now, he's on top. He's got a rifle, and it's got a range of 12, I think. Ooh, jeez, okay. Yeah, range of 12. So can you roll one dice for me to see who he's going to target? Of course. Always me, Alex, always me. Um... Okay, so he's going to... Can he get you? Because he, aren't you covered there? Yeah, but he's going to target me. Okay. So yeah, he can't see me. Okay. So we're fine. Okay, your turn then. You can go diagonally, can't you? Yep. I? He's not in range there, is he? No, no. You can't move through the horses, I'm afraid. Do you, you be in range there? You can't. You won't be able to shoot him from there. Where Where can I shoot him from? Well, you got a range of six, so can't move through the horses, though, can I? No, but if you move there or there, yeah. So you got six. One, two, three, four, five, six. You could shoot him from there. Let's do that then. Right, let's try this. Five or more. Can you use some grit? Yeah, you know what, I'm gonna use some grit. It's re-rolling with grit, guys. That's a grit idea. Hit once. Okay. Right, now he's in cover. So, he's gotta to roll to see if he miss avoids that. Yep, he avoids it. Damn. Um, I could use another grit. 
No, he's avoided the attack. Ah, oh, okay. So, um, remove the dynamite for me. That dynamite. That dynamite. Yeah. Flip the prisoner over. He's run away. Okay, so he's going to be running around. Uh, start from next turn. He's going to be trying to get to the horses. Okay. Um, okay, so roll a d6 for me. So we get uh, two new bad guys come out. Roll the dice to find out where they're coming from. Uh, so that's D. Mm -hmm. And that'll be A, I imagine. Oh man, this is tricky. Okay, hold back the darkness, Alex. Okay. Good man. Mm. Okay, roll into move. Two. Gonna move up there. Your turn? Oh no, it's their turn. So we're gonna see who he's, he's targeting. If it's you, then he's gonna get you. So one, two, three, it's you. No, he's trying for me, but he can't hit me. These guys, that guy's going to go for me. And this guy over here is also going for me. So they've got a move of six. He can hit me. And he can hit me. So six dice. Want to roll low, Alex? Roll low, roll low. And to hit, they need a five. So I've got that, which is three hits, basically. Yeah. So I need to roll three white dice and hopefully avoid these. So that one oops, blocks one hit. I'm going to have um, four damage coming through. So that's fine, four damage. Okay. Your turn, Bandido. Okay, so. Your speed of six. I've got speed of six. If you move next to them, you have to fight them in combat. Okay. Uh, but you are better at punching than you are Go shooting. Go on, I'll do that then. Um... So you have to stop there because you become adjacent to him. Okay. So two dice is your combat. So to hit, you need a four or more. So you hit. Oh, hitting once, yeah. Yep. Okay. So um, roll for damage. You need to get at least a five, right? You need a six to kill him. Oh, you don't do any damage. Um, can I re-roll that? Yeah, use your grip. Six. Six to kill him. Oh. One does nothing. Never mind. Yeah, keep saying that. Right. So, um, our prisoner. He's five. going to move five spaces towards the horses. So if you move them out the top. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five. No. Oh. Why are you moving them a million spaces? No. One. Because you, as I was moving, you counted and it threw me off. Right, so. I was counting what you were doing. Right, okay. So. One, two, three, four, five. Perfect. So he's, he's hot footing as quick as he can. Hold back the darkness, please, Alex. You did not hold back the darkness. Okay, right, roll a d3 to see how many bandits we spawn. d6 divided by two. Four. So we get two more. And can you roll two dice to see where they're coming out? Yeah. So four is d. Can you put one on d for me? And two is b. Oh, man, this is, this is heating up pretty quick. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, so let's see what my roll to move is like. We like grit, Alex. Yeah. Because I can actually shoot people from over here. So I'm going to move. Actually, I can hit both these guys from here, so I'm just going to shoot. Wish me luck. Good luck. So I've got six and a one. I'm going to use a grit to re roll that. 
That's a four, so two hits, one's a crit, so it goes straight through to six damage. This guy's gone. That's 15 experience points for me. And the other guy I hit, I'm gonna put a plus two damage with a dead eye bullet on there. And just get soaked up. So I'm gonna use my last grit to reroll that. Um, so three, it does two damage on him. So he's still alive. So I'm just checking how many experience points I have. Yeah, yeah. 400. And 40. 90. 419. Ooh, close, close, close. Right, we need to see who they're targeting, Alex. So if you just roll... It'll be, it'll, go on, let, let, let me I'll roll um, these two white dice there. You roll two red dice for that side. Or it doesn't matter what colour. But they're one, both coming for me. One for me, one for you. So if we say that guy's for you, that guy's for me. Okay. So let's move him first. So one, two... So I'll move him over there. He's going to shoot you, this guy. One, two, three, four, five, six. He can attack me from over there. Mm -hmm. Um, these guys are both going to try and get to me, so um, he's there. And um, I guess he's going to climb down to try and get me, right? I don't expect so. You're going to stay up there, but you can't hit me because of where I am. Uh, he can't hit me because of line of sight, but these guys can both attack. Oh, he's attacking me, isn't he? Yeah. Okay, so... Maybe it's why the uh, gun was pointing on you. Thank you. It's all right. I didn't mean that. Need a bit of realism. So three dice for the guy attacking me. Always the same. I can't believe that. So there's three hits coming through, which can do up to six damage, which would kill me. So I save one of that. So four damage coming through. I've got two hit points left. Got any bandages? Nope. You only get one at the very beginning. You have to buy them uh, individually. Oh. But I do have, and that's a really good point, I do have my ancient coin, which I can use to heal all my health. Mm -hmm. So go. I've got to wait for my um, next turn. So this guy's attacking you, Alex. So roll three dice, three red dice for the bad guy. This guy's attacking you. So he hits you once. So you roll a one dice to defend. And you take two damage. Okay, let's see how the hot f shoe shuffle goes. Four spaces, Alex. I won't count. Yep. Right, hold back the darkness. Oh, no. Now we see how many people are coming on the board. So roll one dice. Three. Okay, can you roll three dice for me? So what were they? One, five, and two. One, five, and two. So one... Five is a random building rooftop, so three. Oof. So they don't actually have any more bandit to uh, miniatures. Ah, okay. That's it. So I guess that's we just have to stop there, guys. Uh, so hold back the darkness, please, Alex. Two dice. Please, please do it. You son oh. of a bitch. We've got to kill five of these guys now. Okay. Uh, oh, wait. I, I killed one, didn't I? Yeah, you did. So that should have moved down one already. Yeah. So that means we just have to kill four. Okay. Sorry, I forgot to remove them off there. Um, okay, so roll for movement. Okay, not terrible, but not amazing. Um, I can hit both these guys, so I'm gonna try and do that. Oh, I'm gonna use my ancient coin first, Alex, before I forget. Yes. So I've used my ancient coin, which heals me of all wounds. So I'm like bleeding out the side of the building and just rub this coin and suddenly feel better again, but not good enough. I don't have any grit, so I can't do anything about that. Damn, okay. It's their turn, so we're gonna see who they're targeting. If you roll three dice for your side, I'll yeah. roll the three dice for these three. So, four, so. five or six is you, right? Two, 
Okay, so, uh, yeah, so basically all, all of them are attacking me, apart from this guy, who can reach you, so we'll go for him first, because he's got one of these um, rifles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So he gets two shots. So roll two dice, dude. Not those ones, because that's telling us who they're fighting. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that's fine. Okay, misses, you are lucky. Right, so I'm rolling. Three, six, nine. Tw oh, they've got to get into it. So these guys can hit me from where they are. This guy's going to move. Down there. Um. Yeah, okay. And this guy, we've said we, he can't hit me, right? Uh, not from there, no. Yeah, okay. Oh, and he was attacking you anyway, attacking so. Me, yeah. So, three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen dice. One, two, three, four, five, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. If I survive this. I mean, it's not going to happen. Okay, I'm going to leave you 15 little face. Dice. Yeah. Okay. Remember, these are all three hits each. Uh, yeah. The rest of them. Very good. So, is that another 15? It is, isn't it? So, we're rolling 15 dice to try to block out damage here. Each damage that comes through is worth two damage each. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. It's nice, don't you, Alex? Give it face. I block out three hits, four hits. So I'm taking three. Sorry? Oh, uh, he forgot. No, these are all worth three each. Yeah. So two, five, eight, eleven. Times two. So 22 damage I'm taking. Not quite the quickest draw in the West. I think I would have had a quick draw on him, but it's too late now. Right, it's uh, your activation now. Good luck in uh, take stopping these guys. Yeah, I've got a dynamite either. Um, Cause that would have been really sweet. Roll to move. One grip, make it count. All right, um, let's. Uh... If you start moving towards me, cause maybe you can. Um... Maybe you can help. Uh, do you know what? You can't move there because that's that's actually there. Um, so I'm going one two. No, because you'll have to. You'll stand next to the enemy, and then have to fight him in fisticuffs. You shoot at least. You might be able to take out two of them. Good luck. It's up to you. What do you want to do? Do you want to come down my way? What or? can I actually do to help you? There's not a lot I can do, is there? I've got nothing uh, you, to. Yeah, there's nothing you can do at this point. Hmm. I thought we were doing so well, but we're really not. Two misses. Okay, two misses. Let's go out. He's going for it, guys. One hit. One hit. If you get a four, you've killed one of them. Six. Which one do you want? Just, yeah, to take out one of these guys completely. So we move that down one. You get 15 experience points. If only you had 10 more experience points, Alex, I could have leveled up, and then I wouldn't have had to worry about anything. So how much have you got at the moment? Not enough. Not even 400. Or just about 400. So you got 420. We are taking a licking, aren't we? We are. Uh, right, so that's the end of your go. You can move now, though, up to two spaces. And then we'll see how far he moves. Three. 
Um, right, how many bandits do we get? We get three, but there's only one of them left. So he's going to go to B. Uh, and then hold back the darkness, Alex. I'll try. And you oh, fail. Yeah. Okay, uh, so obviously I don't do anything in my turn. They now activate, and there's only one character they can attack, which is you. So. <laughs> Here we go. How well, those guys meet his end. Yeah, those guys can all hit you. Um, so, Alex, you've got. He can hit you. He can... So, we have to do these guys first. So, there's two shots each, Alex. You can do all the rolling for this. Two shots each for them. So, you've got so you two hits there. So, um, you need to roll to save those. Each one of those hits does four damage. Four? Yep. So I need six is on both to... Yeah, you need a four or more to block it. Yep, see, the, the rifle shots kind of hit you, but you kind of dodge out of the way. Yeah. Uh, now you're going to be rolling three, six, nine. Um, he, I don't think he... Yeah, we're going to say his line of sight, right? Yeah, let's do it. Oops. Oops. Do you know what? I don't think he does because he's got to trace the line through there. So it's nine, nine dice you're rolling. Okay. So you're taking three hits from there. One hit, one hit, one hit, three hits, one hit. So I'm just going to put those there because that's three hits. And that's three hits there. So you are rolling... Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten dice. I feel like it's your guys' right final stand. Final stand of Andre King. Let's go out with flashing. Okay, so you've saved. You need four or more, don't you? Yeah. So you're taking six damage. Not six damage, yes. You're taking 12 damage, sorry. So each one does two damage. So you've got two hit points left. Got two hit points left. And we're going to see where this guy moves. Five. So he's getting onto a horse. You know, this is the first time I've ever played this particular mission, uh, which is why I have to keep going going back to this. So he's going to be moving 2d6 towards B, uh, which is this way. Yeah, 2d6, yeah. Not, not right now, next round. So hold back the darkness, please. Yep, so no more. Now you need to take out a bunch of them, Alex. Do you roll for movement? Okay. <laughs> ah, yeah, because he can't get me in there, can he? He can't. And he can't get me from there. And he can't get me from there. He will move to shoot you, though. But can I... You can shoot from the, where you are. Okay. Let's, uh... We need to get a better weapon, don't we, Alex? Yeah. <laughs> let's, uh... Let's do my best. So that's a critical hit, which means you ignore um, armor. So roll that. Yeah, roll that, yeah. Yeah. Three damage. Um, so one, two, three, four. You kill this guy. Yeah. And then roll to see how much damage you do to him. You need to get a four to kill him. That'll do it. Um, you couldn't. I don't think you had line of sight on anybody else. So what do we get for? Um... You get another fifteen. Did I give you any to begin with? I didn't, did I? No. 15, so you get 30. That's all right. So if you give me those 20, you now have 450. 450. You're very close. Okay. And now the, these guys are coming to get their revenge. So um, one, two, three, four, five, six. He's going to stand there. This guy can't hit you, that guy can't hit you. Um, so you've got six dice, Alex. They're attacking you. 
fives or sixes does damage. Okay, so we've got two hits, you've got two dice to defend yourself. If you take even one hit, you are out of it. You take two hits. Damn it, I am so, dead. You are dead. Okay, so failure. The heroes may not visit town, but must begin the next adventure directly. At the start of the next adventure, add one growing dread card to the stack. Um, so we do get to recover all our, our health and sanity, which is fine, but we do have to roll on the, um, the horrible injury chart. So first one you've had to roll on this injury chart. It's, yeah. my, it's my second injury, and I believe if I get another chest wound, I'm dead. Did you find my overdrive? <laughs> yeah, I did, yeah. Okay, I'm going to roll first because I... Uh, I went first. Seven. Concussion. Till the start of the next adventure, you are minus one initiative and roll one less dice on all skill tests. You roll your dice? You know what I never used? Oh, you could have used your iron patch to get yourself grit. We were so close to, to doing that. It's too late now. You could have used that grit to get a dynamite and then chuck the dynamite and killed. I've just suddenly realised that because I thought this was one per game, and it's an adventure. This is our second so I game. Know, I didn't think I could use this until the next time we played. No, it. this is an adventure. Uh, this is why it's always important to know the rules. So roll two dice. You are rolling on this to see what you get. What do you get? Six. Slash leg. You are minus one move. Okay. Until you get this heal, basically. So on your card sheet, or write down in the injury section that you have a slashed leg. And what? Else happens. So we failed at stopping the uh, the bandits. Um, yeah. But I have heard rumor that um, this particular town we're at, they've had some issues with uh, people vanishing in the middle of the night, cattle being drained of blood. Um, so prisoners these, don't vanishing from prison. Prisoners after vanishing after dynamite. You know. That's it. So uh, we're going to go and explore the mines. Uh, and hopefully we'll do better than we have so far. We're, <laughs> we're both very close to actually leveling up. I've got 10 hit points to like, uh, sorry, 10 experience points to um, I level up. 50 away. 50. Uh, so yeah, uh, join us next time and we'll see how we get on in Shadows of Brimstone. Barrett and Enrique decided they would get the hell out of Dodge, or in this case, Small Rock. But what they faced next was far worse than bandits.